President Biden is weighing in tonight on a growing scandal here at home. He's calling on three Los Angeles City Council members, all Democrats, to resign over racist comments heard in a leaked audio recording. CBS's Mark Strassman reports tonight from L.A. They came in outraged. Shame on you. United Shame. against their elected dividers. You are a disgrace. A moment of backroom bigotry captured on a leaked tape. Three Los Angeles City Council members, all Latino Democrats, led by Councilwoman Nuri Martinez. I see a lot of little short, dark people. Here. Hateful comments fired in all directions, and no one pushed back. On these tapes, I have heard the worst of what Los Angeles is. Councilman Mike Bonin's young black son was a Martinez target. On tape in Spanish, she calls him a little monkey. My son? Man, that makes my soul bleed, and it makes my temper burn. Her critics, Nuri's jury, include Bonin, a furious father. First, you must resign and then ask for forgiveness. Martinez was a no-show today, taking what she called a leave of absence. Councilmen Gil Cedillo and Kevin DeLeon showed up, but never spoke. All three have apologized. As I listened to it more and more, I gasped more and more. Gustavo Ariano, a columnist for the Los Angeles Times. I'm glad Latinos especially are being some of the loudest voices against them. If they're on life support now, how much time do they have? That is a question only their arrogance can answer. In this moment, Nuri Martinez is politically radioactive, rejected by her former power base, Latino constituents, and Democratic Party elites who got her elected. Her comments have offended and embarrassed all of them. Nora? Mark Strassman, thank you.